Uh, this demo is about the memory bandwidth performance. We are going to be showing you in here the comparison of the performance of two computing infrastructures, the EPIC, two socket AMD CPUs against the dual socket Intel Broadwell. We're going to be running a high performance computing application. It's a large scale computational fluid dynamics application. And I have already loaded an airplane. It's a 14 million cell problem. I'm going to do the same on the Intel side. And then we're going to do some iterations on this. OK, so it took about 30 seconds to do those 10 iterations. So it's about a little bit less than three seconds per iteration on the AMD side. And then on the Intel side, 5.3 seconds. So it took quite a bit longer on the Intel side and then again we go do the math. It's about 78% faster on the AMD side. Significant performance difference is due to the memory controller performance advantage that we have on the AMD CPU versus the Intel CPU. Uh, the capability of these uh, memory controllers and when you have them all aggregated, the bandwidth that they deliver. Moving data from the main memory to the caches, therefore the cores then start computing with that and then return data back into the main memory and so on. This is a good proxy for a wide range of applications. What we're going to do is use the VR capabilities to get a better experience in terms of the post-processing of 3D. So this allows you to see some details uh, much quicker than if you would just do it uh, just looking into a flat screen. So this is just to improve your experience in terms of the visualization of uh, 3D.